Welcome to your in-depth tutorial for the Beer V2 drone. Today, we'll guide you through every step to ensure you fully leverage its capabilities. Let's start by installing the battery. Align the battery with the slot on the drone, gently insert it, and ensure it's securely locked. Remember, always handle the battery with care and keep it away from extreme temperatures. For the phone rack, slide it into the transmitter's slot and lock it in place. To attach your phone, open the clamp, place your phone securely, and adjust the angle for optimal viewing. Proper preparation is key for a successful flight. Here's how to get your Burv drone ready. 1. Physical check. Ensure all parts are securely attached, especially the propellers and battery. 2. Environment assessment. Choose a clear, open area, free from obstructions and interference. 3. Remote control sync. Turn on the drone and the remote. The drone lights will stabilize, indicating successful synchronization. 4. Gyroscope. Calibration. Perform the gyroscope calibration for stable flight. 5. Final check. Ensure the battery level is adequate and all systems are functioning correctly. To switch on your Burvy2 drone, locate the power button on the drone. Press and hold it until the lights activate, signaling it's powered on. To turn off, simply press and hold the same button until the lights go out. Remember to always switch off the remote control after the drone is powered down to conserve battery. Trimming your drone ensures stable and balanced flight. Here's how to do it. 1. Initial observation. After takeoff, observe the drone's movement. If it drifts in a particular direction without input, it needs trimming. 2. Adjusting. Trim. Locate the trim buttons on your remote. These are typically near the control sticks. 3. Horizontal trim. If the drone drifts sideways, use the horizontal trim buttons. Press the trim button opposite to the direction of drift until the drone stabilizes. 4. Vertical trim. For vertical drift, use the vertical trim buttons. If the drone descends, press the up trim. If it ascends, press the down trim. 5. Fine tuning. Make small adjustments. Over trimming can lead to instability. Adjust gradually until the drone hovers steadily. 6. Retesting. Once trimmed, test the drone by flying it in different directions. Ensure it remains stable and responsive to controls. To activate headless mode, ensure the drone's front, white LED light, faces away from you. Press the headless mode button. The drone's LED will flash, indicating it's active. In this mode, whichever direction you push the joystick, the drone will follow, regardless of its orientation. The one key return is a safety feature. Press the button, and the drone will head back to its launch point. If it's off course, use the right lever to adjust its path. For gyroscope calibration, place the drone on a flat surface. Flick both levers outwards and downwards. This ensures stable and balanced flight. Your Beer V2 drone is equipped with advanced features like flips, gesture photography, and obstacle avoidance. To perform a flip, press the flip button and then push the right joystick in the direction you want the drone to flip. For gesture photography, activate the mode and use hand gestures to control photo capture. The Beer V2 drone comes equipped with an advanced obstacle avoidance system, a feature that significantly enhances safety and ease of operation. Here's how to utilize it. 1. Activation. To activate obstacle avoidance, locate the specific button on your remote control or in the app settings. Engage the feature before takeoff. 2. Functionality. Once activated, the drone uses built-in sensors to detect and avoid obstacles in its path, ensuring a safer flight experience. 3. Limitations and tips. While effective, the obstacle avoidance system has limitations. It may not detect thin or transparent objects. Always keep an eye on the drone and be ready to manually control it in complex environments. 4. Testing the feature. In a safe, open area, test the obstacle avoidance feature by slowly approaching an obstacle. Observe how the drone autonomously alters its path to avoid collision. Installing protective guards on the Beer V2 drone. 1. Identify the guards. Locate the protective guards in your drone kit. 2. Align and attach. Align each guard with the corresponding drone arm. The guards should fit the arm's shape. Snap or screw them into place, being careful not to over-tighten. 3. Secure and test. 
After attaching, check each guard for security. Conduct a short test flight to ensure they don't affect the drone's balance or flight capabilities. The Beer V2 app expands your control. You can add music to your videos, use filters, and control the camera directly from your phone. Pair your phone with the drone, open the app, and you're ready to fly. 1. Connecting the drone. Open the app and connect your drone via Wi-Fi. Follow on-screen instructions for a successful connection. 2. Camera controls. The app provides access to the drone's camera. You can take photos, record videos, and adjust camera settings for optimal shots. 3. Flight modes. Select different flight modes for various experiences, from beginner-friendly settings to advanced maneuvers. 4. Gesture control. Activate gesture control for hands-free photo and video capture. 5. Settings and customization. Customize drone settings according to your preferences for a personalized flying experience. As we wrap up, let's celebrate the Beer V2 drone, a proud Make in India product. It embodies the innovation and excellence of Indian craftsmanship. Flying the Beer V2 isn't just about experiencing its advanced features. It's about embracing a piece of Indian technology and quality. Happy flying with your Beer V2, the symbol of trust and excellence from India. Happy flying.